Hey guys, welcome back for another video. Today I've got this GoPro 10 that I will do like a small unboxing. I've already opened the plastic wrapping of on top of it, but just want to show you the contents of the GoPro 10 box. I bought this GoPro 10 in 2022 September for $349. That is the price with the GoPro subscription. You can save a lot of money on their yearly subscription with when you're buying accessories. And also you can save those photos and videos on cloud. So GoPro subscription, if you're buying new, go with it so in the box as you can see i have bought with some accessories here so as you can see a cloth i'll keep it here some documentation and gopro stickers i'll just put it here camera in between gopro 10 with this blue badging and gopro 10 black written in blue it comes with the standard blue battery so that is a bummer but i'll tell you that GoPro 11 comes with upgraded enduro battery. This comes with a lot of good features. So the weight wise and the exterior dimension wise, it is exactly similar to GoPro 9. So I have done already a video on the media mod accessory fit for GoPro 10, 11 and 9. You can watch that video on my channel already. So in that video, I've explained that media mod basically fits on all these three models. So nothing has changed. Exterior design still stays the same. Other than that, you get some mounts. As you can see, they are GoPro branded mounts. Really good quality. These are few more clamp mount, right? You get the cable. It comes with the USB-C to USB-A cable for charging it. And because I have got this one with the bundle i also get an extra battery which is always handy because these standard batteries you can go with these two batteries for a day when you're shooting outside in in wilderness so at the time these are really good so it comes with one extra battery and it comes with a stick so it's a very small tripod thing it's really small but it's really handy when you're shooting alone you need these things so that you can put it on like like a table or something and then you can shoot from GoPro so really handy really 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 small but really handy good quality material GoPro branded so this also comes with the accessory bundle that I bought so all these things that came in the box so let me talk about the GoPro 10 now so GoPro 10 it has got this sensor if you're taking photos out of that sensor so biggest difference between GoPro 9 versus GoPro 10 was that it comes with hydrophobic coating on the lens now. So your raindrops or any water drops are going to slide down and they're not going to stay, right? When If you are in US, you know when you're using Rain-X, what happens with your windshield, car windshield, the same thing, right? And it comes with upgraded processor, which in my view is really good, which is slightly faster than my GoPro 9. Everything is slightly faster if you compare it to GoPro 9. Processor is faster, so obviously image quality is still better. You get good response times. And if you're clicking pictures from this GoPro, at that time you get 23 megapixel resolution photos, which is a really good resolution to be honest. And it comes with HyperSmooth 4.0, which in 2022 is one of the best stabilization system out there in the market. So GoPro is leading the way in that front. And with GoPro 11, they have already upgraded the HyperSmooth stabilization version. So that is really good. So this is like a quick unboxing and first impression video of GoPro 10. In 2022, I've already told you the price that it comes for $450 if you're buying it outright without any subscription. And it comes for $349 if you're going with GoPro yearly subscription that gives you cloud storage as well as really good discounts on their accessories. So guys, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel and see you in the next one.